Hello everybody and welcome back to Podfox Plays We Happy Few. Where uh we are about to continue the story and talk to the Bobby here at the Megiddo Bridge. Excuse me, I've been asked to check up on Dr. Faraday. Where's Bobby Hickenbotham? The executive committee don't let just anyone drop by the lab, you know. Why not? Because they might be friends of Dr. F. You know what Dr. F could do with a bucket of motorline and a handful of mechanical bits? No, I don't either. And that's the point, isn't it? Mm. He's, uh, <laughs> at the Reform Club. Again. What are you implying? Uh, apparently he feels a bit guilty about Dr. F. You don't know about his, uh, Beauchamp? Bobby Hickenbotham <sighs> is marrying my sister. And I will thank you not to cast any perverted aspersions at his reputation. I have been ordered by the General himself to ask for credentials from the Beautification Committee. Have you got any? There you go. Fine. Watch out for anyone chattering away in something that don't sound like English. They're like mad dogs, and they'll give you plague. And keep your mouth shut about penchants, right? Oh, you better take these, in case you do catch plague over there. Not that I would wait. If you're not a flower or a donner, the garden district is not for you. Okay. You to fight for your enjoyment. Huh. What's this? Oh, that's where I'm supposed to go? Oh, I thought I had to go through like one of these doors. What do these police boxes do? Lud's hole. That's where they quarantined all the wastrels with plague, isn't it? That's a cheery thought. Mm. Are those wastrels with the plague? Uh, what if I uh, put on my my torn suit? Uh, with uh, do I have to have any bad shoes? Okay. Sneaky shoes are now available in your journal. What sneaky shoes? Uh, st sneaky shoes? <laughs> Where's sneaky shoes? Paper mache. Okay. Uh, I guess I just don't get sneaky shoes. Can I make sneaky shoes? Oh. Walk quiet as a cat until the tape tears, though. <laughs> Reduces the sound of your footsteps. Shoes allow you to run longer. Um. Sure. Oh. Fine. Something's contagious. Arthur, you're not bloody mule. Pick what you can carry oh easily. Oh my goodness. This again? This tilts me every time. I don't need this anymore. Oh, I'm still overburdened. Okay. Where's all this rancid stuff that I don't need? Okay, that's a chemical crafting ingredient. Oh, that's a good slice of pie? Oh, okay then. Moldy bread. Nothing. Uh, charcoal, something about toxins, can be brewed, uh, can be used to craft something that's actually good food, stops bleeding, can cause infection, I don't want those, <laughs> uh, oh, well, looks like I... I have so many Jimmy bars. I'm not overburdened anymore, but the next thing I grab will make me overburdened. Okay. He said it was just a cough. 
Well, he's sprouting, isn't he? He said he hadn't got a scratch. I'd call those scratches, wouldn't you? Are you sure it's safe to get that close? You won't catch it from looking. There could be spores. Try not to get bitten. They go a bit crazy towards the end. Thanks. I'll be careful. Run! Wait, you don't want to end up like him. Oh! He's got the madness, hasn't he? Hey, 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 Boy, should he give me the touchy touchy? Okay. Give me this. Give me this. Give me this. You gotta drop some stuff, Arthur, or it's gonna be tediously slow oh, going. Oh, man. Again, dude. I don't know what to drop, man. I like my Jimmy bars. What is this? Crafting ingredient. Always a crafting ingredient. Can be used in crafting. Alright. Oh, I have a lot of empty bottles though, right? And yeah, drop it. Okay. Whoa. Don't I need uh, a gas mask to, to go past this? Uh, all right, I'm just not gonna touch that. How do I get a gas mask? I have skill points. What's my next, what's my next skill that I want? Uh, remove negative effects from hunger, thirst, and exhaustion. That costs 15. Uh, even healthier. Okay. Some weapons can now cause damage to subsequent targets. Prepare an even bigger wallop with a chance to stun. <laughs> Clobber them. Do more damage hitting people. <laughs> Make them bleed more often. Chance of breaking the enemy's weapon with a successful block of your weapon. Spankers, peepers, and jubilators no longer take longer to detect you. Oh, that's what those are. Uh, sp sprinting makes no more noise than walking. Okay, I want that one. Silently pick locks, jimmy windows, and search containers. Jimmy bars and disarming tools last longer. Okay, I'm saving up five. That's what I want. I've changed my mind. That's exact. That's actually what I want. They've really gone out of their way to isolate Dr. Faraday. They must be extremely dangerous. It's fucking stuck. Roger! What did you do to the fucking valve, huh? You over-tightened it, didn't you? Jesus fucking Christ. Whoa. Why'd I have to fall for a stupid fucking mechanical imbecile? I told you to leave the plumbing the uh... fuck alone! You good, bro? What the fuck are you doing Whoa. here? Oh, leave us alone! Why won't you leave us alone? What is your problem, dude? She's going to fucking kill us what? if we keep fucking up! Oh, God. Don't worry, Roger. I'm going to fix it. Because that's what I do, apparently. I'm fucked. We're both fucked. The professor is going to kill us. She's going to tell them to send us away. I'm always mucking things up for her, and well, Roger's worse. He breaks everything. The professor's gonna send us both away. Can you get us a new valve? Um, I'd let you use the professor's lab. Oh, it's brilliant. Dr. Faraday's a woman. It never even occurred to me he'd be a woman. I thought that's what and they she said. she has houseboys. Did you bring a valve? No, well, I'm taking all her stuff. Don't mind me. Just having a bit of a sit down. Get up. That's a that's a lot of hot water. Oh, dude, 
It was literally right here. It, it was it was literally right here. I just want you to know that I appreciate what you do. Oh, brilliant! Oh, this is perfect! Thank you! Oh, you've saved us. Look, go on in. The lab's brilliant. Roger will give you a hug. <laughs> Maybe the professor can help you too. Okay. short for weapon but ideal for casting casting a torch okay uh, I'll make one of those shorts out control boxes for good permanently disable a traffic controls I need some bobby pin duct tape and mechanical bits I'll do that absolutely uh, I don't know what that is but I'll have another one Did I just get a lot of skill points from making stuff? Is that how that works? Uh, where's my shoes at? Where's my shoes? I don't see my shoes. Here we go. Okay. Upgrade workbench. Oh, what's this? <gasps> Gas mask. How do I make that? I need a used up gas mask. And lockers and chests. So is there a locker? Huh? No, okay. No? Rubbing alcohol. mad that I'm doing this. Particular care that could use up oh, gas. Come on, you pack rat. You can't take all these. Yeah, with you can. You. Don't let them. Don't let them say what you need to do, Arthur. Sh shut the door. Okay. Can you stop that music? Oh. Uh. Okay. How do I make a mechanical upgrade kit? <laughs> uh. Okay, you know what? Whatever. stuff going on what's the heaviest thing I have is that but I won't have any more shovels once I have that how do I sort sort by weight okay so what's the heaviest thing I have sort by weight seven three 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 two two one point five okay There we go. I don't need two rubber cat suits. Is this where this music is coming from? Oh, pop. 
power cell. Oh my stuff. goodness. You better throw something away before something starts chasing there. you. Just drop that thing. You don't need it. I don't need to disarm it. Wear your gas mask. Maybe if I hadn't smoked in high school, I could carry a bit more. Wait, do I need to... Nah, do I need to wear my gas mask? Uh, from the desk of Beatrix Shree, voting member, executive committee, Inspector Hockney, instead of wanting to blah, 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 Apple Home Diller, dear Inspector, the clever, the clever bird refused to peck at the nice morsels we offer her. I fear she plans to take wing if you, you know what happens if the ravens flee the tower. I took the precaution of preparing a lovely golden cage at the location we discussed where she can continue to peck. Would you mind conducting her to her new habitat. Of course, we'll need one or two caretakers to keep her feeder filled and change a newspaper. And change a newspaper. I know a couple of confirmed bachelors who are perfect. Dare not make a peep themselves, but they are too stupid to open her cage by themselves. We of the executive committee appreciate all you do. Why have they locked up here? And why? I can't run with all this stuff. You better throw something away before something starts chasing you. <sighs> oh wait, I got my things. Uh, what was it? This one? I have eight points. Oh, I never had this one. Oh. Search and carry bodies faster. So it's either three to five, which is eight. Yeah, I have to do that one. Okay, there we go. All right, I'm overburdened again. There we go. Desk. Oh. That's a waste of a lockpick. That's Latin. Why don't we speak Latin? Because it's 1946 and the Romans left Britain in 450 AD. I can't hear you. Why do you want to speak Latin? You always. You always, you always know, you always know, you always know, you always know, you always know what each, you always know what each word means when it comes out. Impedimenta, the baggage, impedimentorum, of the baggage, and impedimentis, to the baggage. So it doesn't matter what all you say things? Yes. So long as you're talking about baggage. What? No, Arthur, I'm talking about, oh, fuck off. Why are you learning Latin anyway? You still have trouble with English. I can see it in my head. You make the words by sticking endings on them. Well, that seems like an awful lot of effort. When you learn German. When when you learn ge when you I don't want to learn German. You just have to stick the right ending onto the word. I don't want to learn German. It's very good language. It has very strict rules. Imagine my surprise. Okay. <laughs> Why do I hear their random, you know, was I supposed to bring her a sandwich? Oh. <laughs> Your joy really? Wait, why do you care if I'm on my joy? You take oh, your joy be quiet. Jeez. 
Alright. Maybe if I hadn't smoked in high school, I could carry a bit more. Do not disturb Dr. Faraday. Authorized personnel only. Keep pants clear. Transfer tube. City employees only. Eh, I'll just grab a shovel later. That thing's. Oh, Whoa! Hello. You're not James and Roger. Did the executive committee send you? No, no, I, uh. These chaps, they're trying to open the bridge to St. George. What a coincidence. I can't open my own door either. What, what do you mean? You, you're locked in? What did you do? I told the executive committee I wasn't going to make any more spankers, or gates, or clever locks, or keepers, or jubilators. Those are all my designs, you know. They can do that. Then no, I don't work for them. Ah, then you're rather brilliant to have got in, aren't you? Please, will you let me out? Hmm, how? I don't suppose you see a large red button on that side that says... Open the cage? There is a button, but it doesn't say that. Ugh, I was afraid of that. They don't trust those boys out there. I can't say I blame them. I can't trust them not to set themselves on fire. All right. Maybe you can still help me. I was sort of hoping you could tell me how to fix the bridge to St. George. I can. But not till I get out of here. So, I'll need a few things from you. Fair enough? Uh, sure. Brilliant. I need a bucket full of motiline. According to the pressure control grid, there's air in the pipes here. That usually means a leak. Here, take this vacuum. You can keep it afterwards. I don't plan to be anywhere near here. Oh, okay. Well, we'll do all of that. That's random. In the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, subscribe if you'd like to see more content. <laughs> you guys have a wonderful day. I'll see you guys next time.